hello welcome to becky's kitchen so today i'm going to share with you the recipe for homemade chicken pizza if you're coming across this channel for the first time please subscribe and share this video thank you what you need for this recipe is two and a half cups of plain flour two teaspoons of yeast two tablespoons of sugar one teaspoon of salt and mix the dry ingredients one cup of lukewarm water two tablespoons of olive oil or you can use any cooking oil that you have at home After mixing, transfer the dough on the worktop. Sprinkle some flour and put the dough on the mat. So the dough was very soft. So I used half a cup of flour to make the dough a bit harder and to prevent it from sticking because it was very sticky knead the dough for 10 to 15 minutes So the dough as you can see is not sticky take the bowl put one tablespoon of oil and grease the bowl before you put the dough in it Cover with clean film or foil. Cover with kitchen towel and let the dough rise for 1 hour 30 minutes to 2 hours. The dough is ready as you can see this was after 1 hour 30 minutes. So before you put the dough, sprinkle some flour and put the dough on the mat. Divide the dough into two. Let the dough double in size for 30 minutes. Now it's time to prepare the chicken. Cut each chicken breast in half. And these are the spices I'm using. Mixed herbs, paprika, garlic powder, curry and salt. So you season the chicken breast and add some oil. I was using olive oil but you can use um, vegetable oil or any type of cooking oil that you use for your cooking. Then put the pan on the stove. Once the oil is very hot then you can put the chicken breast on the pan and fry it 
until it's cooked. Once the chicken is cooked on this side, you flip it on the other side and cook on medium heat. The chicken is ready. So it's time to make the tomato sauce. I'm making the tomato sauce from scratch. You can use ketchup if you don't want to make it from scratch. So I blended some tomatoes. So this is just uh, blended tomatoes. You can add one tablespoon of sugar. And for those of you who want to season, you can go ahead, but there's no need. So I just added one tablespoon of sugar and let the tomato sauce cook on low heat for five to eight minutes. Now it's time to prepare the toppings. So that's some red onions, red bell pepper, green and yellow. I used half of each bell pepper. Now it's time to cut the chicken in small, small pieces. It was still hot, but not very hot. As you can see, the steam coming out of the chicken. Then I put the chicken in a bowl. As you can see, the dough has doubled in size. Then you take the rolling pin. Now it's time to make the pizza yay then grease the pizza pan with some butter before you put the dough on it because if you don't the pizza is gonna get stuck It's ready now. You can just use the fork, go around, poke the dough. After that, you can take the tomato sauce. This is the tomato sauce that I made from scratch. You can use the one uh, from the store. It's all right. This is mozzarella cheese or you can use cheddar cheese. But mozzarella cheese is best for pizza. You can go ahead and add some onion and the bell peppers. It doesn't matter which one you start with. Yeah. Then after... You don't have to use all the bell peppers because I was making um, two chicken pizzas. So I saved some other toppings for the other pizza so after that then you can put uh, more cheese on top after that you can take uh, one egg or a bit of oil and brush around around the pizza using a small brush or you can use your finger Bake the pizza for 20 minutes on 180 degrees Celsius. Please don't forget to subscribe and share this video. Thank you so much for watching. I'll see you in my next video. Bye.